so left. How's that commute time? <laughs> it's there. <laughs> <laughs> okay, bye. Thanks for the follow. Appreciate you. Welcome in. How's it going? I mean, um, that Super B is almost at least half full. Is it? I, I almost need a 7R just for the ground speed. <laughs> uh, CBM, what's going on? How are you? Welcome in. What's bapping? What's bapping? And these, uh, some of this uh, straws look a little sloppy. Outside the field. Yeah, so you can, in a way, with this comment, you could, like, skip a row. Or skip a pass. Right. Well, I mean, it, with turning it, it lines up perfect. Oh, uh, okay. Welcome in from Portugal. Gosh, damn. I don't know what it is today. Are you yawning? Oh, I can't, like, keep my throat clear. It's a little early to be yawning. Wait, no, I'm not yawning, Trent. That I can't. I'm like, phlegm. I, have, I think I need to start taking allergy meds. That or left got me sick. Okay, blame it on me. You are the one that's sick. I think you coughed in my general direction once. <laughs> uh, and poor Bear's going on a trip. You probably got him sick today, too, you know? I don't think it works like that, but okay. It does. All right, Trent, we got two pass over here, so if you want to start down the long, you're, uh, you're good. In for... There to go. Oh. Right on my way through this, like, waterway. Oh no. Not again. He better sing Soft Kitty to me for getting me sick. <laughs> Speaking of Soft Kitty, where's Kimmy at? Where's Kimmy been? She wasn't here last night either. Yeah, and we played Lulu's. And we, and we, we did oh. not play. We trucked. Last well, night. and we played Lulu's. She was here for that. Well, that's I not know. my Maybe fault. She wasn't. She was... I don't know. She wasn't here last night. Oh, yeah, she wasn't here at all yesterday. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I was saying. We played with was and she wasn't here. But truck, especially. That's a, you know, trucking. Yeah, she missed out on all the fun. Sad times. Sad times. Yeah, that was a lot of fun the last night. A little chaotic there, but you know. But that steering hob, man, look out. I'm a menace to society with that thing on. Well, if. Well, or the next time we do that, I think we should try a, a lighter load up up those logging loads. No, no, no. no. We should. They're heavier. Can we get a modded trailer? It's even heavier. Uh, put some concrete blocks on there like they do the SBMTs, you know? Uh, I know that Railroader has been updated. I personally don't have my update yet. Uh, we were talking about it earlier. It sounds good, though. It sounds good. I'm excited to uh, jump in and check stuff out. I probably won't be in there till Monday, but I'm excited. Hopefully, uh, they did some frame rate. I know there was some stuff with that, so hopefully it's, it's good. Because that's the pro main problem I've been having with the game lately is frame rate. Just... Especially at Bryson the other night, we had like a hundred, I don't know, 120, 130 cars there. Yeah. Yep, yep. Apparently the bathroom at our, at a Denny's is on fire right now. Hmm. How does that happen? If it would have said Taco Bell, I would have believed it. <laughs> Dude, I don't know. Denny's can be kind of wild sometimes, too, you know? <laughs> Just saying. Now that has a half. Oh, that's kind of neat. What? On my, like, double diesels. Okay, are you playing Railroader right now? So, when you hover over it, there's a little circle. And, like, on my single player, I have 463 gallons. 
Yeah. And it's showing like just a little under half. Like uh, the circle is half full or half empty. Only in for a bit, but seems to run better. That's good. That's good. Because, yeah, they, we were having some massive issues the other day with frame rate. Like, what did you see, Trent? Seven? That's just everything that's going on. Yeah. We might have had, like I said, 120 cars or something in pricing. Plus four engines. Yeah. Something like that. Wow. Ooh, Bryson is like brighter. Trying here at the end of your pass. I'm just, I still got to do this a little bit. <laughs> Meanwhile, he's dabbing back into a uh, railroader. Gosh, can't have anything nice. Right there, so was so bad. John definitely can't get a lark. Oh, lark had changed. Oh, the colors? You know, like the color of Robinson? Yeah. Like a almost like a salmon for now, it's like a baby blue, I would say. The salmon's pink. Uh, oh. all uh, Edda is like a pink green, almost, I would say. Yeah, right, so it's like an apple time. orange. Hey, it's, I had my auger out for a reason. <laughs> the power pulls off me. And that might help being in single player as well, yeah. I don't know. It could be. Alrighty. Interesting. And we turn around. At least we're like almost done with this this, this part of this contract. So we don't technically have to pick up all the straw. I would oh, like will. to uh, maybe get like a couple loads of straw into our, our building and then probably just sell the rest because we're going to have more straw tomorrow in game. We're going to have rye. Could always just store like or stuff the building full of straw and yeah. whatever is left over you, I mean, you can still bail it but just sell it. Like yeah, that's what, sell. that's what I'm saying. Yeah, we put some I don't know if we want to fill our building. I guess we might as well. Oh. Yeah. Build the building and then uh, whatever's left we just get rid of. That's no big deal. It's gonna take us a little while though. Definitely gonna take us a while. That's it. Big deal. Not with two rakes and two bailers, it won't. Are you going to clean them all up? We got two wagons. We got six people. We got no, course play. Yes. Are you going to, wait, what part are you going to course play? I don't know. <laughs> we'll figure that out. Because if you want to put a rake out here, that's fine. And a bailer on course play, we could do that. I mean, we have a rake. We have a, you know. You can do that. We can't haul with horse player at auto drive having those three buildings like next to each other. That's not going to work. I feel like that's going to cause problems. We can sell with auto drive, yes. But if we want to haul home, I'd say that's not going to work out. Or you send them somewhere else in the homestead just to like sit. Bye, Dave. Fill the barn. It's closer to run to storage from your own fields. So we shouldn't fill the barn. Right? Oh, we, if we do it, if we fill it with this, then that gives auto drive slash horseplay a chance to get 
or we get ahead of them picking up. I don't know. Because you know how they like to at least have a couple bales on the ground to see. Yeah. Well, that's the wrong button. See, it would make sense to sell more of this field because we're closer to the sell point. As opposed to if we have to bail. We only have two fields. It'll be four and four and nine. So that's not going to be a ton of bales. It's going to be a decent amount. But, but I think we need to lean on the side of caution and, like, sell some more. I don't know. And, and don't forget, we also have field one coming up in a couple days. That will be tons of straw. So, I would say we're going to sell a majority of this field. It's... I would just sell everything. No, we can't sell it all. We need some for our cows. They're out of straw right now. So, that's the first priority. Probably what we'll do is get you guys running rakes and balers. I'll handle the, the holly. If that makes sense. So, two balers and rake. Yeah. But we don't... Okay, Obelis, I think when you're saying fill the barn, you're talking about the cow barn, not the storage barn. Right? We need to fill the cow barn, yes. The woodier stuff now is like a brown instead of gold. Ooh. Kind of like, right. uh, like that sensile color. Or not sensile, uh, like the shade. Yes. Okay. That's that's the problem. When he's saying barn, I'm thinking storage barn, but he's actually meaning cow barn. All right. We're on the same page. Yes. We're going to sell a majority of this field. We will put some. We'll definitely fill the cows up. Yes. Okay. We're all on the same page now, I think. Because, yes, it is closer to run to the homestead from our fields than it is from here. But to sell is not that far from here. It's really far from home. Okay, we're all on the same page. <laughs> it took us a minute to find the page, but I think we're on the same page. John Ryder, what's up, bro? How you doing? So I kicked the smaller green truck over to the homestead. Okay. I say we're and about done hauling, right? There's 76,000 left to go, so it's, what, a Super B and maybe a partial? Super B probably hauls more than that, I think. I don't know, this whole, like, unit convert converts part of the game, but not all of it kind of is annoying. I don't know, I think I got a, another one that does the, uh... It does contracts? I, I don't know about contracts. Because if so, I need that mod. Bring it so out. If you look at your uh, your grain bin, uh huh, it actually shows like bushels instead of like oh. the leaders that you see. We need that too, yeah. We'll need it. All right. Storage is storage. Barn is where the cows. Are. Okay. But it's a storage barn. Uh, we're saying the same thing, just in different ways, you know? Sometimes between, like, different languages and, and text, it's it gets a little, you know, lost. But we got it now. We're all on the same page. A uh, pickup wagon would not actually be any faster. Um, I can haul more tonnage away from the field faster with a... Uh, bail trailer than I can I pick up wagon. That's why we don't use loading wagons, pick up wagons. It's all about the tonnage going away from the field. And I can haul way more tonnage uh, with a bail trailer. Like, a lot more. Especially now that we switched to the smaller bales. Because our trailer holds way more tonnage this way, so... We'll do the, we'll, I'll show you the numbers once we get bailing. 
I'll show you all of it. How much tonnage we're actually hauling off the field per trip. I think you you might be impressed, to be honest. Actually, I have it written down. Do you really? Mm -hmm. Well, that's right. Yeah, yeah, you do. From uh, the other day, yeah. <clears throat> no, we don't use modded pickup wagons, Jacob. We don't do that. Yeah, that took a little while. What's up, Sarge? How was dinner? Oh, we didn't have dinner. Oh, that Just wasn't dinner. Take care of some stuff. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, welcome back. We are uh, just about done with this contract over here. <laughs> Imagine that. <laughs> finally. <laughs> finally. Finally about done. Bail storage facility. Okay. Let me adjust my tie and I say that. Jeez. Tie that I don't have on. Actually, we're going to be on our last passes right now, aren't we? Heck yeah. I'm here for it. I might have to pull some of that barley from storage because I didn't want to oversend. Uh, down at the Zygnus is, uh, it's, it is a, yeah. He's also, he's also kind of sick right now. That's why his name is that. What'd you say? I was. So we might have to pull some of the barley from storage just to fulfill the contract. Why? Uh, probably won't fill the super bees up. But there's Maybe. Some, oh, because you already <laughs> hauled some home. That's why. Okay, I was like, yeah. How does that work? They sent the small one to yeah. the shop. You're good. You're good. You're good. You're the sick one. I'm supposed to. Yep. Mm. Yeah, I got you. Hey, Sarge, I got a new simulator game. I think you would uh, enjoy playing. <laughs> okay. It's called Cat Life Simulator. You're a cat, and you simulate life as a cat. Uh -huh. No, no. <laughs> the trailer did look kind of funny because, like, the cat's just walking along and, like, knocking stuff off, like, the top of a little retaining wall and stuff, like flower pots. Like, that. that's kind of funny. Okay. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to play it, though. But I'm, I might have to look Probably into it when it comes out. There is another one called uh, Storm Chasers. That one actually looks kind of fun. But probably kind of cheesy, too. Wait, is there a tornado intercept vehicle? There is. Away. Anyway. We talked all about simulators. <laughs> you were gone. Uh, oh, what's that? There's a homeless simulator, Sarge. <laughs> when I play John, Sean, you're going on vacation. Sean, you'll be the one that's like, man, this game looks fun. <laughs> I already know, Sean. You're you're totally down for this. Oh, man. You're you're totally gonna play it. Just saying. You'd rather watch me play Supermarket Sim? But what if I'm just a chaos cat? You know? What if I just what if what if you I just choose chaos all the time? That would be kind of funny. Yeah, I'm don't worry, I'm probably not actually gonna play it, John. Okay. The next game that I'm I'm really oh, looking no. for what's up. It won't let me rake. Oh, that's right. We can't rake this. I forgot about that. Alrighty. Yeah. We're gonna rake it. Bad idea. I guess we'll attach fire up the bailers. The next game I'm really looking is uh, the Out of War game. That's that's big time on my radar. Is Out of War. So yeah. John has to leave after this field. I'll go, John. All good. No worries. <coughs> After this pass. Yup. 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 Gotta. 
Yep, Yama Rider, yep. I, I'm going to have to relearn my colors. Yeah, have fun with that. Oh, we've played once a month since December, so four months. Oh, that's true. Okay, fair play, Sean. Yeah. John, John's going on a boat? I'm on a boat, yeah. yeah. Here. Can you, can you, John, please, please, like, play that while you're on the boat, the I'm on a boat song? Please, like, rock out to that while you're on the boat. Please and thank you. Yeah, yeah, I'm right here. I'm looking forward to those. That's probably the biggest thing in the, in the game so far, in the update that, uh, has caught my uh, attention is the FPS upgrades improvements yeah because we were we were struggling the other day you'll do it just for me okay let us know let us know next time you're you're uh you're around how the how the boat red was game uh, i just want to sing that song now and it's so inappropriate the same. Mom Lama 3 just resubscribed for 36 months. This Stardew 1.6 update looks way different than the other streamers. Shout outs <laughs> to three years with the best farm sim streamer Puma Plo Bird Puma Plo Yee -ye. Yo Mama Lama thanks for the resub for 36 months. Holy cow. Well, looks like a uh, field 2 if we wanted to buy that in oops. Bam. I do appreciate it. Uh, definitely Stardew looks a little different here, yeah. Have you been playing the new Stardew update? How is it? Heard it was the thing. I don't play Stardew, but yeah. Yeah, that too, Jacob, yeah. That's definitely... Actually, Trent, this is not our next field, by the way. No. no. Not our next field. It'll be up, up, up back. Got it. It'll be good on beans. I got gotcha. you. What's up, Sarge? Uh, see that we did good on. We did good on what? Sorry, you're quiet. Soybeans. Oh, yeah, we did real good on soybeans. We bought a new grain cart and we still have 900,000. Yeah. Okay, Mama Llama doesn't play Sardew, but a Harvest Moon fan. Okay. Gotcha, Mama Llama. I have to ask my brother-in-law. He's a big Stardew guy. He plays that when he's supposed to be working. Don't tell his company, okay? Don't tell. I need 3,000 liters of barley. Uh, from, like, Homestead? I can get that on the truck and head it towards you. 3,000? That's, mm -hmm. that's like three truckloads. Huh? 3,000? Liters. Oh, liters. The game is like, not like, total over, over two bushels yet. I thought you meant bushels. You got a truck for that or no? Uh, do you take the one from 34 to okay. the homestead? I got it. I got it. I got it. I'll run it. Bushels, not leaders. All right, Buffy, what's going on? How are you? Do you drink mayo in in Stardew? That sounds horrible. John, we'll catch you later, man. Have a good one. <laughs> We'll catch you all next weekend, probably, huh? I'll be here. I should. Lord Whalen and the creek don't rise, right? And I'll tell you what, if the creek rises up enough to get me, y'all are, everybody's in trouble, okay? <laughs> everybody's in trouble. I don't live anywhere near a creek. It'd have to rise like 40 feet to get up here. Probably more than that, actually. 
It's part of the update. You didn't ask questions. Oh, that's right, John. Spring break. I'll be on Tuesday and uh, Thursday night for sure. Tuesday during the day, Thursday night. Playing farm sim. Yeah. You only need a little bit, right? Three, uh, like 3,000 liters, so yeah. I'll just fill a hopper. How about that? I won't sell it all, but I'll fill up. Why not? Yeah, because you got 20. Yeah. Thousand on you? Uh, it should be something. Okay. I need 3,000. Overkill is underrated. Oh. Whoa. All right, John, we'll catch you, bro. He will get you. 577.5 bushels, by the way. But one hopper bolts, just in case anybody was wondering. You're welcome, chat. I know everybody was on the edge of their seat waiting to figure that one out. Or something like that. Nobody cares, I know. Okay. So, Mama Llama, have you heard of Cat Life Simulator? This is going to be my new question anytime anybody comes in here. The same. All right, so Sarge, the plan for the straw off that field, by the way, we're going to we're going to fill up the cows and then probably sell the rest because we're going to have our own straw tomorrow. No, but you heard a stray. Okay. Okay. Pressure on the drive axle. See, the problem about this is I didn't realize that I didn't have a tri drive. Wait, that contract's complete. Never mind it. <clears throat> Guess I don't need all this in, huh? The Super B. The Super B literally emptied as it finished. Okay. Huh. Where's our second baler at? Uh, there's one in the field. Is it going? It's going, maybe? Yeah. And Sarge, I think, has the other one. 178.10, right? But both balers are in the field. We want a third, like, rent to at least a third baler just to bail it. Uh, thanks to the uh, follow. Appreciate you. Welcome in. How's it going? New stream game. Farmer turns cat sim. Oh, dear God, no. Absolutely not. Um, You want to rent a baler? Yeah, just to get the bells going. Where's the 4750? Why is he going to uh, this way? He's I don't know. Here. Somebody put him oh, on he gonna go to repair? Oh. Mm -hmm. I put him on auto drive, but I told him to go home. That's why I was confused. All right. Um, Mama Lava, probably not. First off, but the trailer did look kind of funny, so you never know. You never know. There could be a chance. That one's going home. The other tractors are going home. Okay, what do we have left to run? Oh, we need to move these out of the way. We can fill up the cow barn with the straw. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shush. Cows are so loud. Right. Uh oh. Something in this homestead's taking audio. Is it the field bin, maybe? I know what that was. 
It could be actually really funny, yes. It could be really funny, especially for somebody that doesn't really like cats. You know? It could be, it could be hilarious, yes. Yeah. All right, so what do, what do we got? Who's in the field right now? Trying to get a job. Oh, I'm bailing. Okay, Sarge is bailing. Who's in the other bailer? Be me. Okay. Uh, I think Black Cat was grabbing the other the bail trailer. Uh, left. What are you doing? You gonna grab another bailer? Did you grab it? He may have. Oh, oh jeepers! Yeah, John with nine lives. Well, I just lost one right there, Mama. Gone. Junk. Whew. That's twice today I've had had issues with uh, well stuff on this road. So that's fun. Good gosh. It's unfortunate we can't, uh, <laughs> uh, uh, what's that called? Uh, break it. Yeah. Very unfortunate. Uh, what size bills are we running? These are the small, or wait, these are the, uh, 180. 180, there you go. Well, Baylor, did you lease? The same one. Okay. So three bailers, we should get this done. Pretty, pretty fast. Well, fast is a relative term. I wouldn't get too crazy about worrying about all the skippers and stuff because I know there's a lot of squiggles in this field from us thinking like, oh yeah, we can just rank it. Oh. No, I wouldn't worry about that too much, honestly. But yeah. Tractor looks really good on a baler. That tractor looks good on everything left. I really but, do like that tractor. But with a baler, especially. <laughs> I I like that tractor a lot. It looks good on the grain cart. It looks good on there. I don't. Know, what What did you pull the Pro Force with earlier? Was that that tractor? Yeah, it bullied it a little. I say probably a little big for that tractor. But it still pulled it. Yeah, that's awesome. That tractor looks good on everything. Kind of like the Versatile. The Versatile is just a good looking tractor. A little big for what we're doing right now, but yellow. Fine. Good old. Uh, it's only 303 horsepower. Good old horsepower, right? Only 303. All right. Friday. So if you guys notice, we're, we're, we're purposely making these tiny bales. Because if we make the tiny bales, the trailer is maximized and we can haul more tonnage with the same trailer and less passes, obviously, though, because we're hauling more per pass or more per uh, load. So... I know it might seem silly to make these tiny bales, but it makes sense in the long run. It's 13.89 tons on the small bales. So that was with grass or hay? It was hay. It was hay. I think we was testing that on. And yeah, then... cause I'm going to barely crack a ton on the straw here. Kind of interesting. And I'm not sure what's happening over there. Never know. Around here. 
thought it was I mean, not want to pick that bail up. Trailer's being weird, but apparently not. Alright. There we go. Okay, so now we will unload, reload. Bent. <laughs> oh, I'm going to Cowboard. Oh, that's right. Okay, I had a bail strapped down. So I'm 13.89 tons right now. So it's the same for grass yeah. and straw. Yeah. So 13.8 tons. By the way, we were talking loading wagons earlier, right? If we go to uh, the biggest one in game, and we change that to tons. You're telling me that does 34. Wait, that doesn't work. That's not right. Is it? One of these isn't right. I swear I'm doing this, we can haul way more. 24.8. Yeah, but I'm only hauling 13. Normally we can haul more with the bailer, right? Are we about to have to conduct science? I think we're about to conduct science. Um, I have to let you get that, that road to your left. Alright. Alright, we're conducting science in high speed mode. Don't mind me. I'll see. Okay, here's the other thing though 300 horsepower? Does this John Deere even have that? I have to put the double, the articulated John Deere on it. That's what I have. Yeah. Okay. Don't want to cover anything like that. Okay. The other thing is we don't have a place to store loose straw. So for a storage Cal standpoint. Barn. Yeah, if you drop it straight in cow barn. I know, but like going forward past this in game day. You know what I mean? Just dump it on the ground. No. <laughs> no. Well, Trapped. Yeah, Trent, it'll rot. Oh, will. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I remember doing this forever ago, and I thought for sure that the uh, baler came out, like, way ahead for tonnage. Or was that when we were using those bigger bale trailers? It might, it might have been, have been. with the bigger bale trailers. <laughs> it might have been, yeah. I know loose straw can go straight in the cow barn, but we have to have straw to give our cows in the winter. So how do you, without running like a modded silo that holds everything, how do you, uh, I mean, I guess if we got a commodity shed, right? But. You can only hold so much in those two. You get the haylofts, which we can hurt those yeah. in game. Those hold 250, 250 liters. I just like bailing. You know, I you think can shred the bales and make them loose. I mean, I think that's part of part of part of this whole thing is I just like to bail, guys. You know. You gotta, you gotta take that into consideration too. I like Bailey. I like gold, you know. Or wait, how fast does the Bailey go? Mm -hmm. How fast are you guys going with your Baylers right now? Eleven. Eleven. Okay. Oh. Oh. I was looking at the. the Loose troll saw it storage. Oh, no. We don't have room for that in our homes. And there's the ground in the bucket. And it hold no, we're not putting it on the ground. Not making a mess. We already had a mess this earlier. Who? The parking. Oh well the parking that's one thing, but like to pile a bunch of straw there? I don't know. No mess. No, no. Um, well, too, 
you did get rid of the horse part, so we got room there. I know. We need we need some like we need like extreme farm homestead makeover to come to town, you know. We need money for that first. And yeah, I know. Equipment. And then we need everything. <laughs> I think that's just been a common theme uh, theme on this map so far. We need money. We need, <clears> but, but that's fine because we're playing on hard, so it's that's just the way it is, you know. It's not a big deal. By the way, can you guys see what's happening here? Just for the record, uh, fifty-four percent. I have just under two tons. So, I think the theory is going to hold true. throwing that out so but i'm gonna fill it up and then we'll park it side by side yeah but it's all about tonnage leaving the field i feel like you know i know that bailing's an extra step technically but with square balers i feel like it's not that big of a deal Plus, it's fun. I, I just, I don't know. I enjoy it. I enjoy bailing. I mean, for God's sakes, we bailed 100,000 bales, you know? On one map. Mostly grass, but we did some straw. Mostly grass, though. But we did. We bailed 100,000. That was fun. That was a good time. We had Trent. Well, Trent left. Black Hat. Who else was in on that? Arch. No, oh, with the snake. Oh. Yeah. You know, it's just me and Black Cat. That was terrible. Yeah, it's fun, though. It's terrible. Oh. So, I'm hauling 3.31 tons. L3FT4D3 at Chirdex 100. If we had snuck key, we can really remove the tons. Yeah. We really can remove the tons, yeah. <laughs> Oh, I'm man. A All right, so three point, we'll say 3.31, right? 3.31. And this is hauling 13.98. Black Cat 1 ST cheered Dex 100. I am Snake. <laughs> These are the bits left of Black Cat. So, every time you're leaving the field, which one's more efficient, chat? Which one's more efficient? Every time you're leaving the field. I'm not talking about, like, you know, the, the baking of the bale and everything like that. But going down the road, which one's more efficient? Right? Gotcha, Jeff. Gotcha. So, obviously, the baling, by the time... We should we should calculate that sometime. Take a field and pick it up and haul it to a designated point with a loading wagon, right? And then do that same process with a baler, the baling and then picking up the bales and hauling them to the same place. And compare times. I think you're gonna come out ahead because the the, the multiple trips, you know, down the road. It's gonna, aliens, in my opinion, more efficient, faster. Again, that's my opinion, of course. Especially if you can horse play your bailer. It's even better. But yeah. But at the same time, I'm not telling you guys how to play your game. You know. You guys do you whatever, however you want to play is how you play. I want to bail, so we bail. That's pretty much the end of that, you know? It is what it is. Now the question is, will this tractor with duels fit through the, uh, the door here? All you gotta do is back it in. Ah, oh, we got this. No problem. No problem. All right, Black Hat, hold up on putting that in storage because it's getting its own building. We don't actually want to put any of that storage, honestly. Hold up.
Uh, the mod for the company is called Manual Discharge. Uh, loading wagon or a bail wagon by far, Jacob. This was 3.3. The uh, bales are like a whole, whole lot. 13. So, obviously, um, obviously, bail trailer for the win. Oh, yeah. All right. Uh, how full did that make the cows? Uh, they're full. Okay. So the rest of it goes to sell. All right, because there's no point in putting this uh, in storage and then having to sell our own straw. We might as well save our own straw. Unless it's closer to run this to sell, then. Yep. Alrighty. 100,000 milk. Hey, Trent, there's another 175 slurry for you. <laughs> uh, your favorite thing, right? Favorite thing. Yeah. That's okay. So hopefully that uh, that answers the whole like you know. Yeah. Grant, did you say they were putting legs up or taking legs down? Took a leg down. Interesting. Huh. Wonder why they would do that. Surely they're not like gonna build it in a different place now, are they? Very strange. They might know why. Nope. Nope. Huh. Taking one of the legs down. Interesting. Very weird. So that's why we bail chat. Does that make sense? I don't know. Makes sense to me. Yeah, I guess if you got, you know, six of us on here with loading wagons. But, like, right now, we got three bailers running. Like, they're going to knock that field out pretty fast. We're going to get behind on hauling. Probably already are. But that's okay. There's probably, like, another two trailers already down on the ground or more. Yeah. But I'm focused now. I'm, I'm here. I'm not. The lab code has been uh, retired for now. One more lab coat right now. Hey, so your left, I'm on the pass to your left. All right, uh, Sarge is up to my right on the pass, so. Although I'm always down for some science chat. Keep that in mind as well. Always down for some science. Right. And hey, money. We like money. I like to spend money. I don't know if that counts for anything, but you know. You buy the straw building or a straw bale building? I have not, no. No. We don't need to store any of it. We'll have we will. No. Tomorrow. Wait. It's on order, Trent. They haven't delivered the materials yet. They're gonna build it tomorrow. Um, do we want to drop the little bit of money into field two and harvest it and bail it since it's going to be on cycle? Yeah, we can. It's only like five dollars, right? Forty-four thousand dollars. Are you kidding me, right, meow? We'll have to look at how many trees there are if we want to like actually get the wood chips. Yeah, there's. Maybe five. Oh, right. There's not that much there. What's interesting is this corner of grass right here. Like, what was the thought process here? Building? Or is that how it is in real life? Like, what's there? It's not flat. Though. 
I know it doesn't have to be flat. Makes you wonder. You guys are like half done with this field already, aren't you? Uh, pretty much. Uh, about, yeah. Getting it done. Get done, y'all. Well, through builders kind of helps with that, too. Well, yeah. Yeah, you guys are able to march across the field. No time. Awesome. Tractor guy, what's going on? How are you? What's poppin'? What's your what's your favorite tractor? With a name like Tractor Guy, you gotta have a favorite tractor. Right? 4010 John Deere, I'm calling it. <laughs> uh I'm calling it. I saw a TikTok video where they're like, oh, 9RX, okay. I saw a TikTok video where they're like, there's two two series of tractors that changed changed the game as far as tractors. They were both John Deere. And one was the 4010. Uh, the other one was the 8000 series. Like, yeah, pretty much. For uh, a big, big time tractors in their days. Still got an 8000 somewhere around here. Where's it at? Over there somewhere. Yeah. It's on the other side of the field. Yeah, Is that it right? That's it right there, is it? No. Yeah. Yeah. Or is that the... Yeah. No. Yes. No? No, that's Maybe. the 70 ton. That's... Oh, that's so much. Okay. Yeah. 70, 18. Do I know how to go live on Twitch? Please hold that answer, John. Please hold. <laughs> um, like from a phone or like from a PC or like from the space station or. No, we do that for you every time. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Sarge. I don't know how he does it. He just beep boop bops on his computer and I'm live. Oh, interesting, Jeff. Okay. Interesting. From a laptop. Uh, you need a program called OBS. That's going to be your best bet. Open broadcast software. It's free. There's lots of resources on YouTube on how to like go live on Twitch and stuff. Never had anybody ask me that before. <laughs> oh, I don't know how to go live on Twitch. Nope, never done it. Live on Twitch, right? Now. Yep, Sarge beep pops it. I don't know. It's his years in the military. We just we don't question it. It's like taking down the uh, Chinese rocket debris, right? We don't question. So what you talking? About? <laughs> deny, deny, deny. <laughs> Looking like a real military man, right? I don't know what you're talking about. I didn't, that wasn't me. No oh, idea. This turnaround town is going to be a record. Read about it in the newspaper, same time. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Huh. Uh, just like, yeah, yeah. yeah. My, uh, my uncle has some stories from uh, the Vietnam days. Yeah. The following stream has been pre-recorded. They're AI. In front of a live audience. Yep. Yeah, yeah I'm talking to AI right now. That's what it is, yeah. Oh, and the grass field in IRL is a house. Okay, I f it, that makes sense. That definitely makes sense. I mean, I've gotten the question of like, what program do you use to go live, but how do you, I didn't, yeah, sorry. I shouldn't make fun of the question. There's no such thing as a dumb question. There's questions that yeah, catch me off guard though. My stuff was my natural sarcasm. Oh, you're good, you're good. 
Questions sometimes catch me off guard, and that's definitely one of them. What? Oh, man. All right, we're going to sell. So, John, you know that Starlink hunt is happening today? Sure, yeah. What about so that broke a, uh, another turnaround time. Really? For the booster or for the pad? Yeah, uh, just, just for the pad. How many days? Seven days, 23 hours, and 18 minutes. Seven days. And 23 hours and 18 minutes. So, that's crazy. Pretty good. But as many rockets as they want to fly. You... And the last yeah. record for this pad was eight days, 19 hours. They shaved off a day? Wow. Pretty good. Yeah, but yeah, added a couple hours, but it's yeah, still. But still pretty good. That's a lot of punishment for a bad if you right? think about how many how many launches they do off of a bad. No. It's pretty insane, honestly. Okay, so there's a house at the corner. Okay. I was thinking it was a Walgreens on the corner, of happy and healthy. You know. Dollar General. Soon time for a faster tractor. What is wrong with my Alice? There's no, no, no. Hey, the old JCV. Oh, I was supposed to download that one and test it. Forgot about that. That in the front loader arms for the 8000 series. Kind of forgot about those. Too. Whoopsie. I have them, like a link to them. I just don't have them downloaded yet. Nothing wrong with these tractors. They're just a little slow, but. All right. <laughs> Insane in the memory. All right. All right. I got Start. my GPS all set up. For what? For this field. Oh, for failing? Uh huh. Nice. Very nice. Put it on 30, didn't you? Uh, 3002. 02. All right, got that 02 in there. <laughs> Speaking of 02, makes me think of a person when you say 02. Not somebody that I've ever met, but one of the one of the volunteer fire departments. They all use like numbers, you know. So, yeah. And like there's two numbers and then like O2 is the one guy's like numbers. And that's not giving away anything because I think a lot of departments have an O2. That's like, you know, second in command. Maybe third. Yeah. Anyway. Whenever he's on a scene of, of anything, house fire, car accident, whatever, he nonstop talks on the radio. Like to the point where dispatch, like you can tell they're getting annoyed with him. It's kind of amusing, but he just, he, he just, he just talks a lot, but that's all right. I guess it's part of it. It's all good. Why are there bales in the grass? That's odd, right? Yeah. Over here in this little, little. Uh, that's because I, I emptied my chamber. Oh, that'll do it. Uh, you on your toes. Bam. Yeah. You know, the good part of picking up bales, even with the slow tractor, is you can pretty much keep the cruise control on. Except for when you're right at the empty point, or the sell point. Otherwise, pretty much just uh, zip along. Do your thing. That's kind of nice. And these bales are staggered just so that I can actually, like, pick up more than one room. I'm here for it. Oh, yeah. Oh, gosh. Oh, oh, gosh. That was a tumbling bale right there. So the bale money is going to pay for our bale storage. Wait, that we're going to we buy. buy. Huh? So we had like 900, 
900,000. What did we spend like 20k on? I don't know. What did, what did we spend 20k on? On John. At least oh. that loading wagon. That's not 20k. Is it? Uh, what do I do IRL? I mean, I breathe. And I'm such a smart one today. Uh, this is my job. I, I stream full time. This is my this is my job, if that's what you're asking. But I do lots of things IRL. I uh, I, I have uh, a place that I, I call work. The, well, I have a place that we call the farm that we go to a lot. We work on tractors and I uh, grow about an acre of pumpkins down there. And we do all kinds of fun stuff. Dad and, Dad and I do a lot together. Always uh, hang out. I know what we spent money on. It's what? filled too. Oh. <laughs> the thing that you told me to buy <laughs> and then got mad that. at me because there's no money. I just... Hey, you're, Mr. you're Mr. Money Man over there, John. Hey, Bear's gone for a week and probably not going to watch much. We can spend all the money, okay? Right. Well, we have 887,000, so. So we're buying Phil 3031. No. Hey, we, we can buy another Oxbow. No way. But with the manure. Uh, no. Not no, right no, now. No. Not right now. Efficiency. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so that's, I guess, if you're asking if this is my job, yes, this is my job. This is my job. I just need to sneak in here and grab these last. Yep. All right. Pardon me. And then I turn and the whole load's a little tilty. That's fine. No big deal. No big deal. Cool. Buy field three. Now we bought field two. Uh, plot number three, field number two. We're going to add that into field number one and just make that one field. And then with a nice, uh, I haven't looked at the land yet, but it should work. Uh, let me, I'm going to straightish path here. Okay. Have a nice auto drive, like drive in the field, park, and then be able to drive out of the field. Hopefully, hopefully make that all work. You betcha. Yeah, that is Panther. Yeah, that's the, the left said, hey, we should buy that. And then five minutes later, question for the money. Well, we finally bought it. I'm sick. So don't How much day quill are you on today? Huh? None. I, I tried to order some, but they was out at the uh, general. So. You tried to order day quill? Yeah, on Bro, DoorDash. That would have cost like $95. No. You have to show them your ID when they get there. So that's what's funny. It's like, cause he, they, uh, I got the one in cough drops. Yep. And a little bit, and they kill, they quill capsules actually. They didn't have the capsules. Oh, wow. And then, so, um, he got here, they ended up refunding all the money. But when they got here, he still had to, I still had to show my ID even though the order wasn't, didn't have the day quill. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. I was wondering how that worked. Like, I know you can order like alcohol, and I've always wondered. I guess you got to be there with an ID to show. Yeah, you have to be of okay. age at the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got you. I've just never, never done that, so I didn't. Know. I didn't have any either, so I, I don't. Was like a... I think like you know, I don't order a ton of stuff, but I think I've talked to him literally one time. There was one time I remember watching and like Buddy was like way down the street and about to get out of his car and I just like opened the door and started waving. And then he like drove down here. But my neighborhood's a little confusing on the number system, so it's a little different than uh, most neighborhoods, we'll just say that much. And I'm not gonna tell you why it's different. Yet. It's just different. I don't know the purpose behind why they did what they did, but in my head, it makes sense because I've lived here all my life, but most people that come to this neighborhood, they're like, dude, this neighborhood is back. Just saying. So you can guess what uh, what that is. I'm not, not going not gonna to tell you. Oh, yeah. You bet. 
Did I wave at them like for his gum? Maybe. A little bit. Because <laughs> uh, that's been a fear of mine. It's like, what if they just take it to like somebody else's house? Do I have to like go walk to that house then and, and be like, yeah, don't mind me. I'm just going to get my, you know, McDouble. Like, that's awkward. I don't want that interaction with any of my neighbors. I don't. I no. No, 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 no. All right, let's throw it. Hulk smash. Violence <laughs> is the answer, apparently. Goodness. That's all in the YouTube video I was watching. What? The, the smash. That was from a video? Well, I, it wasn't for me. How loud is your speaker? So? It wasn't for me, John. Sorry, I was getting that cosmic brownie. I'm sorry. All right. Jacob, no. Yeah, so it was a left. Violence is the answer. <laughs> Ooh, look at that perfect like line of bales right here. Watch this, chat. We're gonna, we're gonna just. I, I know I should, shouldn't do this, but look at, look at, yeah, look at him. Perfect. Gotta love it. So what are y'all gonna do when you get done bailing? Because you're not gonna have anything to do with I'm gonna go make, fix me some stuff. Or... Uh, is our grass fills ready to bail? Uh, I think they need another day. They're ready, but they need to, you know. Uh, we're, we're yet. Somebody's gonna have to do one more pass. Just one. Oh, okay. Last you re remind me of something I have in the kitchen. Cosmic brownies? You guys suck. Because <laughs> I don't have any color. I, yeah. Not going to order any either. Not going to get any. Some things in life we just need to not have. Cosmic brownies might be that thing. They are amazing. And delicious. But, I don't need them. Right, Jacob? Okay, we don't have to hear it, Trent. Trent. On it. Rude. Hashtag rude. Like that has some too. He thinks maybe, <laughs> maybe. I don't know. We, we can't hear it, so we, we can't. So left, how's your uh, cockpit, Ronnie? It's pretty delicious. I got another one sitting here. Yeah, I got another one too. <laughs> <laughs> Jacob, I got you. For a while, I should order some of those again. I had these, like, chocolate peanut butter protein bars. They're not, like, the best, but, like, better than eating, like, you know, a candy bar. Yeah, but I still got kind of brownie. No, but they were pretty good. They were pretty good. Debatable. No, they, they were really good. I liked them. I liked them. Facts. Facts. Yeah. So oh, Pops just got home. I'll be interested here if uh, and his truck has any damage to the right, left, or the left rear corner from his boss this morning. Not saying that he hit the truck, but he got real close to it. That he definitely did. So, hopefully not. That's that's where I used to get mine, Jacob. I bet they're the same one. I'll be curious to see if they're the same ones, Jacob, because that's where I used to get. Well, I ordered from Amazon, but Walmart has them too. I wonder, I wonder, I wonder. 
be interested to see Jacob. Really? Send me, just send me the brand name even. Or say it, chat. I don't care. Oh, hey. First time getting stopped by the train coming up here. Well. And no, we're not going to wait for the gates to go up. Not going to do it. Looks like Pops has been to the grocery store. Carrying some groceries, which means probably lots of junk food because he doesn't really buy groceries anymore. Uh, especially with our dishwasher being down, which is fixed now. We got a new one. First time it's feeling much better. Um. <laughs> But uh, I can start cooking again. I didn't want to cook while the dishwasher was down. I I have this first time. I have this terrible habit when I cook. I make so many dishes. What's that? You get what happens when you cook, yeah. Never understood why it takes so long for them to go back up. Yo, no, Joe. I don't know. The left. I think it's time for number two. I was just thinking that actually. Oh. Hey, Jacob, these are different, but did you look good? Different than the, the ones I used to get. Oh, they have a lemon wall. Lemon. Lemon. I'm a big lemon. You put lemon on a two by four. I'll probably eat the two by four, you know? Just saying. I'm a fan. I am a fan of a lemon. I haven't tried the lemon yet. Gotcha. Yeah, she got you. Oh, I need like a little bit left. I think. Oh, so do I. I'm like 46%. I'm oh, 58%. I don't care. Get at least strike Baylor, though. These guys, guys. Fire Shadow, welcome in. We're doing. How are you, Fire? I'm going to ask for you, you know. Ah, uh, definitely Jacob. Yep, everybody has a different taste. You betcha. That is definitely a fact. I don't remember the brand name already. Literally, I just looked at him. Jacob will have to tell you. I don't remember what they're called already. I'd have to open it back up. There's so many bales down here, guys. Guys, guys left a mess. <laughs> They're this way and that way. It's like a Wonka Vader. They're just, they're just everywhere. I like your complaining. A little bit. Yeah. What's it to you? I don't care. Yeah, you have cosmic friendies, therefore you don't care about anything. Spent four days helping one of your brothers this week. Dang. Dang. Hope it was fun stuff. I don't know. That's crazy. All right. So, uh, all the way down here in the corner is done. Working my way back. Great. Nice. Okay. So, with the ASMR. ASMR. Right. Okay, guys, you take up. Here, took point. Anyway. Uh, what time is it? It's, it is dead time, isn't it? I didn't realize what time it was again. This is twice today. I've, like, missed my break time. Goodness.
Making a parts run and pulling wire. Any, well, not any, but a lot of situations can be fun depending on your attitude or who you're hanging out with or whatever, right? Right? Yeah. I can remember pouring a concrete pad at my brother's house. Um, and it was like a ton of work and a very long day. But it was a good time. And, and we like got together as a family and like got it done, you know? It might have been like 5,000 pounds of like sack crete that day. Uh, all three, like a, a tow behind, make sure you tow behind like your like pickup truck. That was fun. Yeah. That was fun. But yeah, like 5,000 pounds. It was a lot. Sense of accomplishment's pretty good. Yes, aesthetic, yes. And Jacob, you're not wrong. Not wrong at all. It takes forever. Yeah. Actually, static, that's stuff that I used to uh used to preach whenever I'd get like a different helper cut uh cut grass with me back in the day. Like it was always my brothers and I. And then after that it kind of changed to like some friends, you know, would help me out. And whenever we would get like their first first uh, first time out with me, whenever we'd get a yard done and it looked good, which you know our yards always did look good, and we got them done. I'd be like, now take a second and just look at that yard. We just look at it. Well, especially because like I would let them use the bigger like the 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 big more, you know. I'd let them use the more, and I'd be like, and you you did this, you know. Look at how good that looks, and you did this. Now let's get, take that same pride and put it to every yard that we, you know, every yard we mow. Yeah, I would always preach that to him. He never really listened, but you know, you gotta try, right? Oh, time to fertilize field too. Oh yeah, yeah, true. And we gotta lime it too. What's going on? Welcome in. Thanks for the uh, follow. Appreciate it. Zero, we're doing, man. How are you doing today? Welcome in. What's bad? You're a farmer in Brazil. Welcome in. What are what are you growing right now in Brazil? Should be good on bales, okay. All right, Sean's good on bales. Sean's good on bales. For sure. Rods. Soybeans well, is, and corn. This is a shopping cart. What? Do you want to try it? Whoa, it's whatever Black Cat posted. Uh, exactly, Static, exactly. You never know, man. You never, ever know. Soybeans and corn. That's what we grow here uh, in Missouri, up here in the United States as well. A lot of soybeans and corn around me. A little bit of uh, wheat, but mostly soybeans and corn. Lots of soy and corn here. Oh, this doesn't even have... Okay. Be uh, planting and what? Less than a month. Less than a month planting will start around here. Good beginning. Okay. Gotcha. Gotcha. That's not a bad idea, Jeff. Yeah, I can see flatten that out a little bit. I can see that. Yeah. 
Gotcha, zero, gotcha. Oh, there's only like six trees, maybe seven trees. Okay, that's not worth getting the crux for the top crux, though. Other thing you do for... Oh, that's not bad. Uh, be able to try them all. They're like Pokemons. They're like Pokemons. Gotta catch them all. You guys actually break out fertilizer and lime and stuff for that field? Hey. Might as well, right? So we'll probably have auto drive like come. Wait, we gotta do a little landscaping across there, right? Uh. Yeah. Just smoothing. That's about it. Yeah. We'll probably have auto drive turn in here, park somewhere right up here, and then go out at the top of the hill, or maybe the hey, other way. You didn't see it either. Turn in. What? This this fence was uh kind of kind of funny. Did you drive over the fence again? No, I uh. I almost spoiled what I did in ATS. Ah. Uh, but you weren't looking the, the right that. direction. Yeah. Okay, bye. Alright, so I'm gonna park this and I'm gonna. Uh, do you want a fast time? We just want a fast time a day? Oh, wait, you guys keep working. I'm gonna take a little break. Uh, nice. I have no sound over here. I think it's. Awesome. it's yeah, one of those things over there is Robin Sound. It's that cow barn. <laughs> no, no, it's not the cow barn. It's not been the cow barn this whole time. I think it's either the field bin or that tank. Uh, I guess we can complete the contract first, though, right? I mean, we are done bailing. Yeah. Uh, nothing on sale we need, right? Just that two plus two. Unfortunately, we don't, we don't, I mean, whatever, it's fine. We don't have to have it. We don't have to be nice to, we don't have to. Yeah, well. Oh, raining, we're not raining. Okay, nothing we need no. in the sail barn. Sail time. Sail time? Oh, it's already harvest, though. The oats are ready, the grass is ready, the alfalfa is on first day, so I say we don't do that. Um, the uh, wheat is ready. So, oh, we got jobs to do. Cows need there's, to be fed again. There's two bushes I can't... I think these are just bushes, though. Yeah. The manure heap is even fuller than when I took my break at 3 o'clock. I'll be right back, guys. <laughs> 